Hi my Dazzlers, welcome back. So today I'm going to show you tips and tricks that will give your face a nice lift, will make your face look more youthful, more plump and more toned. Please comment on below which trick was your favorite. Any tips and tricks you would want to share with the audience. Alright guys, so let's get started. Before we get started, let's talk about the BB cream that I recently got. Most of the BB creams conceal your dark spots and blemishes to give even toned skin temporarily. The Dermacose 2% Nacinamide Hydrating BB Cream with SPF 30 PA++ is the perfect blend of makeup and skincare. It heals your skin by reducing acne marks and spots and provides the necessary hydration. Also look at the coverage it gives. Wow! And the best part is, it now comes in three different shades, ivory, nude, and warm beige. All products by the Dermaco are fragrance-free. Every time you make a purchase, you extend your support to more than 10,000 students. Use my coupon code SUSH2023 to get 20% off. Everything will be mentioned in the description box. Since I already have my BB cream on, now I'm going to go in with the concealer. So I just apply my concealer like I would normally under my eyes and then just blend it then what i'm going to do is i'm just going to take a contour shade i'm going to take this darker contour shade i'm going to contour my eyes so i'm just going to start from here and bring it near the hairline create it slightly upward next taking the bronzer i'm going to bronze my face normally i would bronze my face right here but now since i want to give my face some lift so i'll just Put it slightly higher than where I usually put my bronzer. Just like that and then blend it. I usually put my blush on the cheeks like right here. But today I'm going to put it on the sides of my cheeks. And a little higher than I usually do. And then when you blend it, bring it a little higher towards your temples. Now take a concealer lighter than your skin tone and just create a line here on the outer corners of your eyes near your nose and then where your ear starts and then near your mouth. Now just remember everything should go up like this, not in the downward direction but upward. And now we are going to blend it. Also remember to blend up not down. You can already see the difference between these two sides. This side looks a little bit more uplifted than this side. Now we're going to use a cream tint on our eyelids. Now I'm going to set my under eye area using a loose powder. Now I'm going to take a brown kajal and apply it on my upper lash line. I'm going to tight line it on the first half of my upper lash line and leave the second half. I'm not going to tight line it. I'm going to create a straight line, like imagine a straight line from the middle of my eyelids till the end and draw that and then connect it and fill it in. Do you see how it instantly gave a lift to my right eye? And now I'm going to take my brown kajal and apply it on my lower lash line. And I'm also going to start from the mid of my eyes and then go towards the end. Now with my fingers, I'm just going to blend it a little bit so that it doesn't look that harsh. And now for my eyebrows, I'm just going to fill my eyebrows and just leave the end of the brows a little lighter so that it does not drag your face down. Don't go heavy handed towards the end. For the lipstick, tap the lipstick on your lips. I just tap a little bit of lipstick on my lips and then blend it with my fingers. It gives more natural look on the lips. Just makes your lips look more natural. For the lip liner, take a nude lip liner. Start from the center of your lips. Just create a straight line on your cupid's bow. And then just draw a line following the natural lip line. Don't overdraw your lips on both the sides of the lips. Just overdraw a little bit on the cupid's bow on the bottom lip as well just draw a line following the natural line of your lips now what you do is just rub it off with your fingers so that it doesn't appear to be really harsh do the same with your cupid's bow and it'll instantly make your lips look bigger and look more plump Next, always, always curl your lashes before you apply mascara. And then apply mascara. Apply two coats, three coats, whatever you're comfortable with. I am just applying a single coat. Next, I'm going to take a highlighter and apply it on the high points 
of my face, brow bone area, inner corners of my eyes. That's it guys. So these are the tips and tricks that you can use to make your face look more lifted and more youthful and more plump. I hope you liked this video and if you did, then do subscribe to my channel and I'm going to see you in my next video. Till then go forth and dazzle.